Welcome to Variety Videos. This is Watsal and in this video I will show you how to properly install Windows 7 on your system. So firstly insert your Windows 7 installation CD in your drive and then restart your system. Then go to boot options. For me it's here F12. So I will press F12 to start boot options. So now here you have to select the boot device from hard drive to CD DVD device. After following this you can see something like this. Windows is loading files. After that you will see this window and here you have to select your language. After that here select your time and currency format and then select your keyboard or input method and then click on next. Now here you can see some options like install now, repair your computer etc. So here we will select install now because here in this video we are doing a fresh installation. Now here tick I accept and then click on next. Now click on custom. Now here you can see a list of your hard drive partitions. Now here partition 3 is my primary drive on which I have already installed my Windows 7. So basically it's the drive on which I want to reinstall my Windows 7. So here below you can see some options like refresh, delete, format etc. Now here we have to click on delete. Now before clicking on delete make sure that you have selected the correct partition because it will be deleted and this is the partition on which we are going to reinstall our Windows 7. Now here you can see a warning message. You can click on OK now. Now our partition 3 is deleted so you can see here unallocated space. Now select that partition and click on new. Now here you can see the partition size. It's about 239229 MB. Now leave it as it is. And then click apply. Now our partition 3 is formatted and ready for fresh installation. So here we actually did not formatted the drive but we deleted the partition but you can also format and reinstall. So now click on next. Now you can see in this window that our windows installation has started. So now sit back and let it be completed. Make sure that during the installation your system will restart several times. So don't worry about it. Now here you don't have to press anything and just let your system start. Here I want to clarify that my windows installation CD is still inserted in my drive. Setup is starting services. Completing installation. Now here you can read that setup will continue after restarting your computer. So don't remove your installation CD. Now again you don't have to press anything here and let your system boot. Starting windows. Setup is preparing your computer for first use. Setup is checking video performance. Now here you have to type a username and click on next. You can set a password here if you want and then click on next. I will select use recommended settings here. Now select your time zone and click on next. Preparing your desktop. And now you can see your home screen. So it means that our windows installation has completed. Now you can just remove your windows installation DVD and insert your driver CD and then install your required drivers for your system. Here in this video I am installing drivers on my system and that's Dell Inspiron N5110. And please note that this part of the video is optional so you don't have to follow this necessarily. I usually install these drivers after my windows reinstallation. In your case it might be different. So that's it guys, if you find this video helpful, you can press the like button, give your feedback in the comment section, you can also ask questions there. Share this video with your friends and don't forget to hit the red subscribe button to join my channel for free and enjoy my variety of videos. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.